Hi, kids. Uh, so we're going to be, I'm going to show you about how to uh, basically clean the body of the baritone and a couple other instruments. Um, what you really need is a, a decent um, terry cloth. Uh, you know, I've got Harry Hippo here. Um, and we have our valves and our slides soaking, which, um, you know, lets them sit in some warm water for a little bit until we clean them down. But right now I'm going to show you how to uh, bathe the instrument. Um, and pretty much you treat it like a baby. Some people say, this is my baby. Uh, well, this baby must have fallen out and hit its head because it needs a little bit of work. Falling out of bed one day. Uh, so uh, what we do, ordinarily, if I'm in the shower, I'll take the, the hose and flush the instrument through. Um, but, you know, you don't always have a shower. So what I do sometimes, you scoop up a little bit of the nice water. It's in the instrument now. You want to hear that? You get a little bit of shake. It's in there, right? Now, I just take Mr. Harry Hippo. No, it's grody! It's grody! It's grody, Mr. Hippo. That's right. And what happens is, you know, instruments get used, they get handled. They get, it's weird, they get handled by hands. Hmm. Hands have oils on them. Oils create corrosion. And I will show you some corrosion from hands. You hear all that air coming through? Ah. You hear that? That's air. That's the water moving through the valves. And you just turn it all around and flush it out. And I do that a couple times. If I have just a, a you know, a, if I don't have a way to flush it with a hose, 